Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest in Canada. I'm going to show you the solution for the February 2011 Grade 7-8 Contest, Question 23. So the question is, I'm two times as old as John was when I was as old as he is now. How old am I if the sum of my and John's ages is 70? But that is easy because it, it's just m plus j equals 70. So now the harder statement, and that is, I am, so m equals, So two times as old as John was when I was as old as he is now. So that is John minus some years. An example of that would be if I was eight years older than John, then eight years ago I was as old as John is now. So the age difference is just m minus j. So a minus sign in front of a bracket changes the sign of each term. So this minus sign would change plus m to minus m and it would change minus j to plus j. So that would be so that would be j minus m plus j. So we can simplify this by just adding up j plus j, which is 2j, 2 times j, and then subtract that by m. So, when you have a factor in front of a bracket, that you multiply that to each term. So you would do 2 times 2 times j minus 2 times m. And that would just be 4j minus 2m. So now, since we want m on one side, and we have minus two, at 2 times m on this side, we would have to do plus 2 times m. So on the left side, we would have m plus 2m is 3m, and on the right side, we would just have 4 times j. So now, since we cannot simplify this anymore, we have to look at this equation, which is m plus j equals 70. So we want to find out m but j is in the way. So we have to look at this equation. So we could do j equals m 70 minus m. So 
So now we have 3 times m equals 4 times j, but we, will, we would substitute this for j, so it would actually be 3 times m. And that would be 70 minus m. So, so now we would do what we did before because if we have a factor in front of a bracket, then we multiply that to each term. So that would be 4 times 70, which is 280. And then here we have minus 4 times m. So, since we have 4 times m, and we have 3 times m here, that would be 7 times m equals 280. So we would divide 280 by 7, and that would be 40, so m equals 40. If we know that m equals 40, then we know that j equals 30, because they both have to add up to 70. So let's check with this equation just to see if we were actually correct. So we would start from the inside and work ourselves out. So that would be m minus j, which is 40 minus 30, which is 10. And here we have j minus 10, which is 30 minus 10, so that is 20. And we have 2 times 20, which is 40. And then we have m equals 40. And that is exactly what we want. So we know the answer is m equals 40. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca caribou.